Okay, so I finally decided to make a tutorial video for the entrance hall. It goes over all of the different setups that I use for all the various tricks to this map. So the most important part is making sure that you have jump bound to at least one of your mouse wheel scroll directions. I prefer using both of the mouse wheel directions so you can spam up and down to get really rapid jump inputs, but just having one bound is sufficient for the tricks in this map. Using space, you're not really able to get as many jump inputs as you need to get on top of this balcony right here and on top of the pillar up there consistently. So after you have this keybind set up, we're just going to run over here to this rubble, rub our face up against this piece of stair bit right here, then line our cursor up with the left side of this block of pixels. Once we get our cursor lined up on this left side right here, we're going to hold sprint, run forward, spam jump. That's enough to put you on top of this balcony right here. Next part, we need to get on top of this pillar. To do that, I like running towards it, and then before I actually get to the pillar, I'm going to jump so that I reach it at about the height of my jump right here. And then after I hit the pillar, and put some more jumps, and it gets you on top of this thing. If you just rub your face up against this thing and try and spam jump to get on top of it, the geometry doesn't let you up nearly as easily. So just take the jump from a bit, a bit back. After we're up here, I'm going to run into this corner in between the window frame and the pillar to the right. Now to get into this window, I usually just jerk my camera to the left really fast, um, run and jump forward, let go of sprint, press crouch, and then swing my camera back to the right to get into this thing. Um, the most important part here is to remember to let go of sprint before you press crouch during this jump, because if you're still holding sprint while you crouch, then immediately after crouching you're going to uncrouch because you're running, so after doing the running jump off of this pillar, you want to let go and then crouch. That should put you in the window right here. Next part, I'm going to run to the back of this window and then do a couple jump inputs. That pops our head out of the bound or out of bounds right here. Then we're going to run to the right side of this pillar. And that should push our character model down a little bit. Then we turn left, and that clips us to the floor. It's important whenever you're falling through the floor right there, to switch your key inputs from running forward to running forward into the right, or running forward into the left. That way you won't fall off into the abyss. From this point, we just need to get to the door over there. It's as easy as falling off safely on top of the ceiling right here, jumping over some bits of geometry, and doing a door dive. Alright, that's entrance hall. Thanks for watching.